So you're going through your project and you need to divide something in half. Let's just say that you need to cut five and three quarters of an inch in half. You need to find the center point on that. Now, in this tab measure, it doesn't have the, uh, all those extra fancy numbers and fractions and stuff that'll tell you exactly where the center is. Uh, personally, I don't care for those ones simply because it's way too many numbers, way too many fractions that they have written all over the thing. All right, so this is how I do it. What you're gonna do is you're gonna take the five. Now, half of five is gonna be what? Two and a half. Half of three quarter. Now, this is where some people get really, really confused. To cut a fraction in half, all you do, keep top number the same, and you double the bottom number. Okay? So now, the measurement that you need to find on your tape measure is gonna be two and a half and then another three eighths. Now, how am I gonna do that? Are we going to add this together? No. You could, but that's just way too much work. All right, let me zoom in a little bit. I'm going to show you how we're going to do this. Let's see, still see the numbers right there. Okay. So, two and a half is right there. Now, we're going to add three eighths of an inch to that two and a half. Now, on your tape measure, at least on this tape measure, these intermediate halfway marks. Those are going to be eighths of an inch. All right, these little bitty ones are going to be sixteenths. Okay, and we're not going to worry about those. We're only counting the eighths of an inch, and we're going to need three of those eighths. All right, so again, start at two and a half, right there. Then we're going to add three eighths to it. One, two, three. This is going to be your center mark. Okay, now when you look back at the rest of your ruler or uh, your tape measure, that's going to be two and seven eighths. All right, that is going to be. The center mark, two and seven eighths. Make it look like an eight. There we go. Two and seven eighths. That's going to be your center for the five and three quarters. Okay. Simple as that. You kind of need to know how to, you know, count by fractions a little bit. You need to know a little bit about your your tape measure and how it's laid out. Um, 